the prevalence of television, this effectiveness, has invited uh, technology to come in and do even more. And we as a people are easily distracted and television comes with novelty and you know we follow it you know like kids following the Pied Piper. There is the danger that in our adoration for the technology that gives us television we will throw out the baby with the bath. We will forget the story that held our interest at the breakfast table. And once we forget that we become what Edward Murrow feared we might become, a box with wires. You know, I pray, I fight, I hope that with all of our technical and technological permutations, with all our excellences that we are creating, we never forget that the purpose behind it all is to bring that story that was so important at the breakfast table to life, that we mustn't compromise our humanity you know, in order to create excellence in the world of technology. Technology was created for humanity, not humanity created for technology. I would say te uh, uh, television, in the generic term, may be the most powerful communicative force on the face of the earth now, with the power to create changes that took centuries to achieve in the past. And that's a great uh, a gift, but also a great threat. You know, if we leave behind our humanity, if, if our capacity to care for each other, uh, our, our, our need to love, our need to heal, and pursuit of sensations that, you know, have begin and end in themselves, if we do that, television will help destroy the very world television helped to create.